Hey everyone, it's Tracy. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do another part in sort of my setup series. That's what I've started calling it. Um, because I kinda wanna get this ready for the new year. I should say for the new second half of the year. <laughs> so you know what I forgot though? I forgot my name. Let me go grab one, hold on. Because it's not official till you put your name in it. Okay, so I think I'm gonna do this one. And by the way, I got these from Robin. I'll leave the link down to her shop uh, below. And actually, I'll link directly to uh, the custom uh, name link so you guys can see that too in case you're interested in these. So she was, um, I ordered my name and then she was great enough to make um, the Midwest Craft Chat for me, which I didn't even think about. So those are great. And you can see you get all the different sizes on there. Um, yeah, it's fabulous. So... Let's go ahead and put my name. And actually, I'm gonna put it over where it says, this is my life. And I'm gonna put Midwest Craft Chat on the line below it. That'll work. And um, let's see, what else do I have here? Okay. I think I'm gonna use one of my little parts here. There we go. Okay, so this is the section I wanna work on today. This is gonna be the section I, I keep for my subscriptions, uh, the dates that they're due and whatnot. So since we're starting this in July, I thought it would be kind of fun to utilize some of my July pieces from Simply Smith. I have a ton of this, and even though I'm going to be using it, I'm still going to have a ton of it. So I thought it would be kind of fun to see what I have here. I'm wondering if these would be fun to put up in the top, maybe even like this, because I have a ton of those. Let's see, two, three, four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight. Yeah, I have several. Okay, so you know what? I think that's what we're gonna do. I think we're gonna put that up here. Um, so let's start by doing that. I like to use as much, you know, of my stuff as I can. Um, and this is just a cute little way to do that. I kind of want that dark line showing. So we're going to make sure we're lining it up here. That looks pretty even. I had thought about doing a seasonal thing where I was doing like something different on each of the boxes and I debated about that for a little while, which is why it actually took me um, a little more time to come out with this video because that's kind of what I was thinking about doing. But then I just, I really like the idea of, of doing the red, white, and blue. Um, I am starting this in July and I thought, you know, why not? I think that'll just be a good way to go. So, and I like the fact that this also makes a nice presentation and it makes it consistent then as you guys know you know my husband my family you know many of my loved ones served in the military so I'm very all about the red white and blue anyhow and I thought this was a nice way not only to use up some of the stuff that I had but to also show support for that so that is two of them I kind of like the way that looks guys you know what, I think I wanna put something up at the top too. No, that's too many flowers. Will one of these fit? No, okay. We'll see what else we have here. <laughs> I've got a ton of stuff, so <laughs> we'll figure something out, but we're gonna put something up at the top. Oh, and I have given consideration. I think I'm going to try once in a while to use a Daily Duo kit. And I know I mentioned that before. I wasn't going to really get into that too much. I've decided I might do one or two of them a month. And here's why. Um, I think it would be cute. I think it would be different. And again, like you guys know, I like a decorated planner. I want to stay engaged with my planner, which is why I'm decorating it. So... I feel like if I don't decorate it, oh, we got some decorations here. Speaking of, oh, I know what we can do. 
<laughs> Sorry, I'm all distracted. <laughs> Let's do this up here. And should I do this one or this one? Let's do this one. Oh my gosh, guys, look how cute that looks. I'm gonna come back to that one, so we're gonna put that off to the side. Okay, so anyway, as I was saying, you know, I wanna stay engaged in my planner. And I feel like, you know, putting in a daily duo kit once in a while would be cute. And since I'm, you know, kind of taking out that one extra page that is uh, Saturday, Sunday, every week, I think I'm gonna have more than enough room. Um, and if I discover I, you know, I don't have enough room to do that, or if the planner's getting really thick, I can always kind of, you know, like throttle back on that. But I feel like it would be really cute to do. So that's what we're doing. <laughs> Okay. I just, I really enjoy, you know, looking at the decorations. I enjoy having them, you know. I, I could never, you know, and I've tried actually, let me, oh, that's not right. I've actually tried doing the planners undecorated. I have. And I don't do well with them because they're boring. And so then I don't look at it, I don't use it, and that's a problem. You know, the whole point of, of having the planner is to use it. Um, so we want to make sure we're staying on target, and this is the way I'm going to do it. <laughs> okay. Last one. Gosh, I love how that looks. And I don't care that it's, you know... Um, the same for every month. I'm fine with that. I mean, 4th of July is coming. Uh, Patriot Day is coming. Uh, Veterans Day. You know, all of that. So, it's fine. You know, Pearl Harbor Day even. You know, so it's all there. It's coming. I love that. So, you know, that makes me totally happy. Now, I think what I'm going to do is pop up here. Should we do here or here? I kind of like the idea of doing it there, but I think that would end up covering some of that. So maybe we do, yeah, that's not going to work. Where can I stick that? How far would that cover it? You know what? We're still going to do it. Because I'm not really going to use the calendars. They're just there, so I have the dates. Um, I'm not going to be actually using those calendars for anything. I'm not going to mark anything on them, I don't think. I mean, I might highlight dates. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. But let's see. Let's turn it this way. Oh, that's cute. It doesn't cover the dates. It just covers, like... Yeah, so whatever. That's fine. I like it anyway. <laughs> okay, now, um, what else do I want to do? Maybe I'll do a line here. So let's see what washi we have. Again, ton of stuff. That's why I thought, you know, I've, I've gotten so many of these, um, you know, the little freebies and stuff. I thought it would be cute to kind of use them. And let's see, we have other decor, by the way. So let's hold that out for a second because I might use those. Um, oh, here we go. Maybe I'll use the two thinner strips, right? That'll work because I can do maybe one at the top and one at the bottom. That might be cute. Let's do that. Or should I do one of these and now let's do the two thinner ones <laughs> so indecisive <laughs> Ooh. her blade must have been a little dull okay so i'm gonna try and pop this right under the calendars though and hopefully i can get this even Does that look straight? 
We all know I'm good for crooked. Actually, that does look pretty straight. Maybe just a little. Yeah, that looks pretty straight. Okay, let's cut that off at the end here. That works there. And let's do the other one at the bottom. And then maybe I'll put a cute piece of decor in that corner. Now this one, I'm gonna go right under the line so that I have, you know, that last full space. There we go. Oh, that looks really cute. I like it. Okay. So, there we are so far. Now, let's see. I don't know if I want to do one of these in the bottom. I mean, I do have a ton of them. Or do I want to do one of these? No, let's stick to this one. I have a ton. So, let's just do that. The whole point of this is to use things up a little bit. So, let's use it up. Now, I'm going to cut this off a little bit on the bottom so that it flattens and I can put it right on that washi strip. Let's see. There we go. That works, and that's another sticker used. Okay, so I think that'll work out really well. Um, Again, I might highlight dates in here. We'll see. But the whole point of this section is to actually have where I can write down, like, on the first, you know, I do subscribe to Jane's Agenda, but am I getting it or not? Um, and then also, you know, like, say, for instance, this is July. So I'll write down what I've subscribed to, what I, you know, decided to skip. And then maybe I wrote a notation for the dates that I need to do the following month. So it'll be July, August, September, October, November, December. <coughs> you know what? Let me see if I have months I can put there. Hold on. I do. So these are actually from Robin. I put this on a spare um, silicone page from one of my reusable sticker books. And these are some of the months that I had left over. So let's go ahead and do this. So we'll do July. August. September, is that straight? I feel like that's crooked. There we go. September, October, November, and December. And what I like is this, this is a consistent theme then. You know, like I said, I, I had debated about doing the strips that, you know, matched more of a seasonal type of theme, but I just felt it was going to look a little too chaotic here. So this is good. Okay. So I will leave the link down below for those as well. So um, you'll have the link for her um, custom name uh, listing as well as her months. But I will also put her YouTube channel and her shop link down there in general. So you'll have all of that. And just so you know, uh, the code is CraftChat15, C-R-A-F-T-C-H-A-T-1-5. That will give you 15% off your order if there isn't already a sale going on. So I like it, guys. I hope you like it, too. Um, the next thing we're going to do, not today, but the next thing we'll do is uh, set up my first week. I've already written in the dates for July 1st through the 7th. Um, so we'll set up the first full week. Um, and I think that that is going to be fun. Uh, we will probably do that within the next week or two here because, again, I want to get this all squared away so it's all ready to go um, because the summer, like I said, it's a busier time for me. I, I've got a lot of stuff to do outside. So I want to make sure I'm setting myself up for success with my planners um, 
And I figure by doing it earlier, that's going to be a better way to make that happen. So in any case, guys, thank you so much for joining me today. I really appreciate you being here. Um, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you have any questions, leave them down below and I will talk to you soon. Bye.